If you're looking to get into gear with a green option for your vehicle this year, then 2022 may have just the right menu for you. Here are the EVs you can expect to be available in showrooms this year. First up is the EV offering from Tata Group, the Tata Altros. After showcasing it in 2019 at the Geneva Motor Show, this homegrown brand is adding to the list of EVs after the Nexon and the Tigor. The buzz on pricing puts the tag at an affordable 13 lakh rupees while it boasts of getting 250 kilometers on a single charge. Staying vocal for local, the Mahindra Group will drive into 2022 with the electric XUV300, which was delayed due to the global chip shortage. Likely to be priced above the 15 lakh mark, this EV reportedly clocks in 140 kilometers on a single battery charge. Next up, the Hyundai Kona Electric, India's first long-range EV, and it returns this year with a facelift as well as a reworked price tag of 25 lakh rupees. However, the South Korean car maker has remained hushed about the changes that are being incorporated. BMW is definitely in the fast lane when it comes to electric vehicles. With an expected range of about 350 km on a single battery charge, the BMW i4 is expected to see a mid-year launch and will cost you north of 90 lakh rupees. The i4 is not the only offering from the BMW pack. After the first all-electric hatchback from Mini was sold out in just two hours after the opening of bookings in October, the car maker returns with more ammunition. The new Mini Cooper SE has a configuration that lets the EV sprint from 0 to 60 km an hour in 3.9 seconds, while the 100 km an hour speed is achieved in 7.3 seconds. With the ability to ride over 230 km in a single charge, this EV will reportedly cost you over 60 lakh rupees. And of course, we saved the best for last. With the ability to drive out 770 kilometers on a single charge, Mercedes is set to mark the entry of the S-Class of electric cars in India with the Mercedes-Benz EQS. And it comes with a hefty bill of over 2 crore rupees. The notable name missing from this list is the Musk-backed Tesla Model 3, which has done test drives in India already, but continues the battle on import taxes with the government, while others get into the fast lane with EV launches.